Pogi the Yogi, and I'm so glad you're here. I've got a new Pogi pal I'd like you to meet. Her name is Elena Stacy, and she's a singer-songwriter. Hey, Pogi, how's it going? <laughs> it's going well. Hi, awesome. Elena. Come on and sit down. Oh, thank you. How are you doing? I'm really well, thank you. How are you? Good. Wow. This is really cool. Where are we? We are at a music venue in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Oh, and what are you up to today? Well, I am about to play a show tonight here. I am going to play a ton of different songs, mostly that I wrote myself. That's really impressive. You write your own music. Um, where do you get your ideas from? I get my ideas from all around. Things that I see, things that I experience, things that I feel. I really love to write about my feelings. Wow. So writing about your feelings must be a pretty personal experience and sounds like you probably have to share a lot with people. It is very personal and sometimes that can be scary to let people know how you're feeling inside, but um, oftentimes I'll find out that the person I'm expressing my song to has felt the exact same way and it helps us to connect. Oh, so, so it's like you, you see yourself in the other person, the other person sees themselves in you. Exactly. <laughs> That's so fun. Hey, Pogi. Would you like to hear a song? Ooh, absolutely. Awesome. This is one that I wrote for my baby brother. They brought you home In a blue and white blanket And I looked over At a perfect tiny Baby, and for the first time I was bigger than someone Cause I wasn't even to myself And Mama said it's time for bed And I said you go to bed And I'll take care of the baby, of the baby Oh, Elena, that's so special. Thank I, you. I just I really felt down inside and kind of made me cry a little bit. That's so sweet. Thank you so much. I'm so glad that it made you feel the feelings I was feeling when I wrote it. Wow. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Pokey, would you like to try holding the guitar? I, yeah, that would be great. Yeah, Thank absolutely. You. Okay. Ooh, oh, sorry. <laughs> and you can strum it a little bit, play, try playing it if you okay, like. Okay, sure. I have it in an open tuning right now, so anyone can play it. <laughs> well, I don't know if I can play it very well, but I can <laughs> certainly strum it a little bit. Thank you. So what do I do with this hand? Well, uh, with, our, with this hand, we press down the strings in different, these are called frets, okay. in different frets to change the sounds of the strings. So you can just mess around with it. And if you want to use this, it's called a pick. Oh, okay. You can use that to strum the strings. Alrighty. Oh. Hey. Good job! <laughs> I like how you're mimicking what I did to, you know, to try out the strings. That's really cool. Uh, Elena, thank you so much for sharing what you love with me and teaching me a little bit about playing guitar and singing. It was just really special, and I really like hearing you sing. Thank you so much. Thank you for being interested in what I do. I love to share my music, and I'm actually going to be playing here in just a little bit. Will you stick around and listen? Oh, absolutely. That'd be so fun. Thank you. Of course. Thank you. <laughs> She's got nobbies in the kitchen, nobbies in her purse, 